Dockers great Aaron Sandilands has called time on his decorated 18-year career in purple. The Fremantle Ruckman will farewell Perth fans on Saturday night, saying he owes it to the supporters who've given him so much love. Unsure if he'd ever return from a calf injury, seven-year-old Sloane Sanderlands offered 36-year-old Dad some last advice. She said, Dad, um, you're, too, uh, you're too young and you've only just got back playing again. So, <laughs> And then in the next breath she said, make sure you man up. So, <laughs> Talked out of retirement earlier this year, Sandy gave it one last go. It was good to get back to be able to play again this year, but there was always a fair bit of doubt that you know, would be able to go on beyond this year. Fremantle's final two games will be his last. He told teammates this morning. I couldn't look Ballas in the eye. That was probably the, the hardest part because you spend so much time with a, a quality bunch of guys. It is um, extremely hard to, to come out and say that it's all over. At his peak, he was the game's best ruckman. Sandlin's brilliantly. Drafted as a rookie in 2002, the 211 centimetre giant turned into a four-time All-Australian. Jewel Doig medalist with a pair of Glen Denning medals, rising to the occasion in the fiercest of Western derbies. The fan favourite will hang up his size 18 boots, having played the third most games for the club. I was pretty keen to, to walk off into the sunset and, and not really announce anything, but... Um... You know, I think I owe it to a lot of people to say thank you. He's not sure he'll stay involved at Fremantle, but there's already a family business ready to go. Yeah, Gecko contracting, if you want to know. We're... <laughs> Joshua Dore, Nine News.